Mamma Mia! Who wants to play a game? -a? Hi, I'm Matt with TTPM, and today I'm playing with Monopoly Gamer Collector's Edition from Hasbro Games. Monopoly Gamer is for two to four players ages eight and up. At first glance, Monopoly Gamer may come off as a mere licensed version of Monopoly with a Super Mario theme, but it's much more than that. The game comes with a game board, instructions, five stickers, two dice, 90 coins, 33 cards, and five character tokens, including Mario, Donkey Kong, Princess Peach, Yoshi, and Bowser. The game board is clearly a Monopoly board with many of the same classic spaces with a twist. The board still has property spaces, but instead of Marvin Gardens and St. James Place, you can buy the painted swampland and rock candy mines. The players move around the board with two dice. One is a classic die numbered one through six, and the other is a power-up die. The power-up die activates your character's abilities, allowing you bonus moves on each turn. And instead of money, players collect, what else? Golden coins. When you land on or pass go, it's time to fight a boss. There are eight bosses in total, including seven Koopalings and the final and most dangerous boss, Bowser Jr. Roll to fight a boss, and a win earns you coins, properties, and other delights. Additional game spaces include a superstar, which activates your character's powers, a coin block for additional coins, a thwomp, which causes you to lose coins, and my favorite, the warp pipe, which quickly moves you from one pipe to another. And just like in Mario Brothers games, if you see some coins along the way, make sure to grab them before someone else does. The game ends after the final boss fight, and then all players add up their points collected from properties, boss fight wins, and golden coins. Need more characters? No problem. Sold separately are Wario, Diddy Kong, Fire Mario, Toad, Rosalina, Tanuki Mario, and of course, Luigi. They're sold in blind packs, so you won't know what you're getting until you open it. I am really happy to see that this is not just another licensed board game that plays the same way and just has a few lazily added character images. The gameplay honors classic Monopoly but has enough Mario elements to give it a unique experience. Monopoly Gamer may not please the Monopoly purists and it may pale in comparison to what video gamers would expect, but it's still fun and challenging. Personally, I am a fan of both Monopoly and Mario but a complete fanatic of neither. So I like it and I'm hoping to someday see Pac-Man Scrabble or Space Invaders Candyland. But until then, you'll find me rolling dice and collecting coins. For where to buy and current prices, find us at TTPM and subscribe to our YouTube channels for more reviews every day.